From the moment you step off your plane till the moment that you step into your hotel, how long does Disney's Magical Express take? Well, today we're going to find out. Let's hop into it. Hello and welcome to the Park Hop. My name is Jacob and today we're going to be taking a look at a common question people have when they're planning a Walt Disney World vacation. And that question is how long does Disney's Magical Express take? For those of you who don't know, Disney's Magical Express is Disney's complimentary bus service that takes people who are staying at select Disney Resort hotels right to their hotel from the Orlando International Airport. Now, that doesn't mean all Disney World hotels, only Disney-owned and operated hotels. So if you're staying at Bonnet Creek, if you're staying at the Four Seasons or the Swan or Dolphin, you're not going to be getting on this bus. But for everybody else, you're going to be able to have the opportunity to get a quick bus ride from MCO to your hotel and not have to rent a car or pay parking fees or anything like that. Now, when you ask the question, how long will it take, you're going to get a lot of different answers depending upon who you ask. For instance, when you sign up for the Magical Express, Disney sends you a letter like with a stamp and everything, and it says that it's going to take you anywhere from 45 to 75 minutes travel time. Well, if you look at the Disney Parks Moms panel online, they say it's anywhere from 30 to 50 minutes. So which one of those things is it? Well, it's kind of both and kind of neither. It really depends on where you start the clock. Does it start when you get in line to check in for the Magical Express? Does it start when you actually check in and scan your Magic Band that first time? Does it start when you sit down on the bus or does it start when the bus pulls away from the airport? All of those things take time. And so that's why you're going to get a different answer every time you ask somebody. So I think that the best way for us to get usable information is to ask how long it takes from the moment you step off your plane to the moment you step into the lobby of your hotel when you're using Disney's Magical Express. Well, to get that answer, at least in one instance, we take you to this plane landing already in progress. Just got off the plane, eight o'clock on the dot. The APM is now departing. There is something for everyone. Enjoy your visit. It's on the B side of the airport, and I went to the A side of the airport. Now at the check in area at 818. All right, we've checked in. Uh, we're waiting for our bus. So it'll just be a few minutes. It is 8.25. On the bus at exactly 8.30. Eight forty six, and we are pulling away from the airport. Nine oh eight AM, and we are on Disney property. It is 9.12 a.m. and we have arrived at our first stop, which is Saratoga Springs. Our stop is the next one, which is French Quarter. Nine twenty-three, and we have made it to French Quarter. Eight a.m. to nine twenty-three. That's one hour and twenty-three minutes. That's the answer, right? Well, yes and no. It really depends on a lot of different things. For instance, if you were watching the video, you saw that I ended up in the wrong side of the airport just because I wasn't paying attention. And that kind of brings us to our first variable to think about when we're trying to figure out how long it's going to take. 
If you find your way slowly, use the restroom, stop for food, or otherwise take your time getting to the Magical Express check-in, then your overall time is going to be longer. If there's a limited number of check-in agents or the people in front of you have problems checking in, you may end up in a line that causes a delay. Alternatively, you could have no wait at all before scanning your magic band and getting on your bus. If you arrive at your assigned bus and find it almost full, that's good news. The sooner it fills up, the sooner you'll pull away from the airport. Disney can control a lot, but they can't control the traffic. If there's an accident or construction between MCO and Disney property, all bets are off. Your bus will make multiple stops at multiple resorts. For instance, the bus in our example got to Saratoga Springs in 1 hour and 12 minutes. If we had been getting off at Riverside instead of French Quarter, it would have likely taken us about an hour and a half. One thing that won't slow you down is waiting for your bags. Using the yellow checked baggage tags that Disney provides means your bags will be picked up for you and delivered to your resort within about three hours of your arrival at that resort. All right, if there are all of these variables, how do we know how long it's gonna take? Well, we don't know exactly, but what we do know from my experience and the experience of those that I've spoken with is that there is a general time frame that you can pretty much count on. From your plane to your hotel, it's going to usually take you between 60 and 90 minutes. So if you know what time your plane is arriving and you want to start making fast pass reservations, you want to start making dining reservations, you can start at your arrival time and work backwards from there, obviously building in buffer to get wherever you're going. But it's going to take you usually between 60 and and 90 minutes to get from your plane to your hotel lobby. It's not a guarantee, but it's a pretty good guideline. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, subscribe and click the notification icon. If you have questions about Disney's Magical Express or you have an experience of your own that you want to talk about, or if you think I am way off and I've got this entirely wrong, just let us know down in the comments and we'll talk about it. Until the next time, my name is Jacob and I'm reminding you to gather your belongings, watch your head and step, and take all small children by the hair. Hand.